before we show you how to spray tan your client, we want to show you one of the most important steps and that's having their skin prepped. It's so important to make sure that your client has exfoliated 24 to 48 hours before their spray tan. They can use either the Eco Tan Exfoliant Glove or our Pink Himalayan Salt Scrub. You want to be sure that they don't prep their skin and exfoliate the same day as their tan as they may rub off too much of the dead skin cells. And with our Eco Tan Organic Solutions, you need those dead skin cells just to make sure that we adhere to them because we don't penetrate deep into the skin. We don't use any artificial dyes or colors, so we need those dead skin cells. So this way, as long as they prep 24 to 48 hours before, they'll be perfect. They can, like I said, use either the glove or the scrub, or what I prefer is the two together. So we, before we start our spray tan demonstration, one of the most important things that you'll need to do is to be sure that you have your gun on the proper setting. And the best way to do this is when you receive your gun, to be sure to turn it down to the lowest setting and then start by turning it up. Once you turn your gun on, you want to make sure that you're about five inches away from your client, about five to six. And with that, you want to have, I would say about a four inch to five inch wide spray. So I'm just going to demonstrate on a piece of paper. You can see right here, I'm about four inches. So this is a really good spray. That's what you'd like to have. So in this spray tan demonstration, we're going to be spraying Savannah in our beautiful certified organic Eco Tan Rich Honey solution. Now with this technique, you'll be able to use either our Rich Honey or our two solution, but for this demonstration, we will use Rich Honey um, for one, the skin tone of Savannah and as well as the fact that it does have a darker bronzer in it, so you'll be able to see it in the video. Um, and if you had a look at our other videos, we did demonstrate how to make sure that your gun is properly tuned so that you have a perfect even tan and you're using the right amount of solution on the perfect setting. With both of our solutions, we do recommend that you use two ounces, but be sure to fill your gun up just a little bit more than that, maybe four to five ounces, so that you never get stuck in the middle of a spray tan with for whatever reason running out a solution or if you just happen to use a little bit more. So be sure that you fill your gun more, but the way you'll also be able to check if you're using the right amount is you want to make sure you use about two solution, uh, two ounces of the solution when you're when you're finished. So to start a demonstration, I'm going to have Savannah turn around and also put your arms out please and face them down like this. Yep, and you can bend your elbows perfect. So we're going to start on her back and we're going to work our way from top to bottom. Then we're going to have her start turning around and doing the rest of her body. We focus on her neck and face last because it sometimes you will get some of those clients who will be looking around and you don't want them to have any creases in their neck or even their arms. So just wanted to keep you in mind why we're starting with the back. It is always the easiest. So just in case your client does happen to move around a lot, really nothing can go wrong with the back. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the machine on and we are using the Maximus Allure machine. Um, another point you'll also notice, you want to make sure that you're going in the right, um, I'll say just the right timing. So you don't want to spray them too fast and you don't want to spray them too slow. You just want it to be just right. So I'm going to turn the machine on and I already have my gun properly set in the correct setting and we're going to be spraying from top to bottom starting with her back. So we're going to spray in this direction. You can see I'm going quickly making sure you want to make sure that you follow the contours of her body when you're spraying her. You don't want to be too far away in some of her spots. So we're going to do her upper back and then we're going to all start with her legs. You may have to get down just like I am on your knees. It's totally perfect. You want to make sure you're spray tearing with the contours of her body. I'm 
be too far away or too close. You want to be approximately five to six inches away. So I'll have you turn around. And the reason why you don't want to be too far away is if you are, you're going to get way too much overspray. And if you're too close, you're going to have too much solution spraying on your bird, on your client. And that way you might get drips or any issues that you just don't want. So now I'm going to start with our stomach.
so you can see this machine is super simple to use. This is super easy to do. You can wa wipe your tent down when you're done. Um, the one point of advice I do give you is to make sure that you properly clean your gun. Um, either if you just use some distilled water, put it in the cup and turn your gun on and get some of uh, the rest of the spray tan that's in there, you want to make sure that you clean your gun and that you don't just uh, leave it for quite a few days um, because you will have that sediment, sediment built up in it. Again, last but not least, you have to make sure that your client does not walk away without these two items. These are the cream of the crop and tan extending. We have our winter skin, which is an amazing moisturizer, but it also has a hint of a tan in it just to ensure that that tan will maybe even extend an extra day or two, but also the entire life of the tan will look just as flawless as the first day. And because we wash our face so much and our face just takes a beating, one of the best ways to make sure that that face just has that beautiful glow and that tan extension is with face tan water. Super easy to use. They can use this every few days couple days in a row, whatever is easiest for them, and this will ensure that their tent will add that extra day or two and always look just as good as the first day. Again, if you have any questions, please feel free to email us, sales at organicskinusa.com. You can also visit our website, www.organicskinusa.com, and we thank you so much for taking the time to watch our video, and let us know if there's anything we can do for you. Thanks again.